Hello, ladies and gents. I am the Rev. Welcome on back to more Osiris New Dawn. Well, the devs have finally fixed the progression, but they changed some things around. Now you have to get um, Zirconion and a couple other things to make and get past making the rover. Before it was much easier, but. Don't worry, I'm here, I'm going to show you guys how to get everything, what you're supposed to do. So, when we last left off, we had gotten to the point where we needed to turn on the radar. So, I started over because they did work on the save system and how it saves the missions as you go. But your current save, wherever you're stuck at, if you're at this point where I am, I was, the last video, yeah, uh, it's broken and can't be, can't be done, can't really be worked with. So what do you do? Well, we needed one black key still. So the best thing to do is repair this storage locker right here. You will get, not that, you will get this key right here. And you will be good to go. That's just extra. Now, you see all of these. These are from running in the mines, which you'll pick up. You can get the solar panel, uh, train drill, smart bin data, and a beacon data disk. And to open those, you go over your access computers. They come up here. You click on them. Now, to get the other ones that you actually need to progress. So, again, once you start, once you've got the point where you're repairing your base, right? Repair the whole thing. And you start doing this then start going through and fixing just about everything not everything but i went through i fixed it a bunch of different things just experimenting that one didn't seem like it gave anything but you want to come over and you want to get this storage locker and that storage locker because they will give you the plans they'll give you the uh, liquid tank data excrement collector uh, hydrogen battery data and then the important thing printer data desk and chemistry station those are the two that you're going to need to be able to make the zircon stuff And these are powered by themselves, I guess, which is nice. I didn't have to uh, run the power distributor or anything over here. This is the only way you can make the zirconium circuit board right now. Uh, the other one that you can find is the uh, square production thing that we used to have. Uh, I think you can find that plan somewhere also in the caves, but it takes a lot of time to do that. But... That's the big thing you'll make there. You can make uh, inflatable dame kits, come computer screams from scratch. You don't have to find broken ones. And then the chem station, rubber, plastic, batteries, uh, hydrazine to run your rover that's behind me. You got to get nitrogen and hydrogen. You put those in the um, barrels that you make. And I think that is pretty much it. So, at this point, we got to go back over because I want to show you guys uh, the radar dish. That has changed too. And then we'll actually pick up from there. But there you go. Your printer, which that printer, vital. Because without those zirconian things, you can't do the rover. And if you don't fix the rover... You can't go any further in the story mission. So hold on a second here. I'm going to drive over to that. Radio station tower thing again. Hold on a sec. Yeah, I see you, dude. Asta. All righty, folks, we're back. So, you'll know how if you, you did this correctly. If you come up here and it says enter password. So, 
So establish communication relay power to operate sat link. We got to get a get three of the. Oh, you son of a! God, they all followed me. Oh, by the way, the devs did say that they're going to be working on the creature AI, bringing more AI in, more creatures back in. They just wanted to get the story done. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the story, and then once they release more, uh, some of the uh, other things out, we will, I'll probably start a whole brand new series and strategies and stuff to get through. Hey, pardon me. This is where we go. There's usually bugs in this first part. But they, these guys don't hurt you. Because they haven't fixed the AI on them yet. You can kill them and make um, chow out of them, but they don't do anything to you. Always a good idea to double check. Right. Top everything off. Let's see, we got a long ways to go here. Calm's away. And you put your weapon away, you'll move on much quicker. So we're gonna try and follow the way it tells us to go here. We'll see if it actually lets us accomplish that goal. Well, this is a way you can go. Well, maybe we can get in, get going over this way. Otherwise, we're going to have to run around with our heads cut off underground to find where we're supposed to go. All right, all right. Well, one thing I always like to hit, very least, I'm gonna grab that just in case. Empty. Oh, a whole, a whole barrel. We'll take that. Those are expensive to make. Normally, if it has oxygen, I always try and hit those. But and batteries. That stuff does add up in weight. Something to keep in mind. Now, if you're claustrophobic, I don't know what to tell you. But, they put this uh, update in the experimental branch a couple of days ago. Wait a minute. Let's see, what do we got here? Oh, we'll always take more ammo. Another data disc, we'll take that. Vital oh. stabilized. There we go. A little bit of everything. Supposedly, these guys, I think they all connect in one extent or another. Some of the entrances are kind of hid. You don't know what to look for. You might miss them. I actually don't think I need anything. Which is always nice, you get that point in the game. But yeah, as I've been going through and uh, waiting for these guys to finally get everything going, the devs, um, I made a point of uh, working on my guides, so I have all kinds of new information for you guys. Next time we do a playthrough of this. But we still got a bunch to go. I kind of have an idea of what's coming up. Kind of. But I wanted to do it with you guys, at least the first time. Well, we're slowly getting there. Gosh. Ooh. Okay. 
Oop. Oh, there's a green key. My best tip right now, as soon as you can when you start the game, try and get it in the mines. Gotta be careful, there's stuff like this in here, but... Here we go, here we go. And what do we get for all our hard work? Oh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Vital <sighs> stabilized. Man, I am a gluttonous pig in these caves. All right. Activate Calm Relay 2. Alrighty, folks, we are in the Bloodleaf Forest. Right here. Oh, look. Zirconian. Zirconian, in case you're looking for it, all over the map. More on the outside edges of the map than anywhere else. But. Let's see. We gotta go this way. Vital stabilized. Okay. I ran through here once already. But I forgot to hit record. So we'll do it again. It's not that big of a run. It's actually pretty quick. And then I got another idea where I think the next one might be. Just because of the way they're kind of setting these up. Kind of seems like uh, one to two different caves go to each thing. This one right here says right here... Uh, Relay comms. Oh, look, we've got friends. Oh. Where'd the other one go? Yeah, they could get stuck. There you go. That one's already online, so that's the second relay. So hold on. We'll see if I'm correct. There's only two other mines I think it can possibly be, so... Hold on. Alright, folks, so remember where we first started the game out at. This is the easiest way for me to show you where this next mine is. I mean, it's like, out of all the mines and the places to start us... This bad boy is right here. If it's not this one, it should be the one that's over in the upper left corner of the map. One of the two. Yep, comms relay three. You need a blue key. But by this point, that shouldn't be a problem. That's right. And going through here, you'll see there is a bunch of stuff. Cobalt. Silver. I mean, all kinds of stuff. So if we need a whole bunch of electronic stuff. Base parts. Gold. There's some mercury in here. All kinds of crap. Not too bad here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Relay generator. Is that the room that we needed? We need the comms relay.
There it is. This is the one. This one's in its own little weird thing. Okay. Oh, God. Now we got to go all the way back. I think. Offline, online. Oh, well. Small bug. So, what we'll do... Is now I've showed you guys where all the calm relays are. In the next episode, we will stop, start back at the dish, because I think it sends us to a ship or something else next. All right, ladies and gents, there you go. There are what to do once you turn on the satellite dish, the three relay stations. And when we come back, we'll start that dish. I think it's going to send us maybe to a spaceship we'll have to repair, which I'm sure will take a lot of work. But as always... Make sure you like, favorite, subscribe to the old channel. I need all the help I can get. And keep your heads down. Your funky looking dudes up. And I'll see you again real damn soon.